Easter is just days away, and if you have to get any last-minute shopping in, you're likely going to spend more at the grocery store. CBS 17 Harrison Grubb is joining us now live, and uh, you've been crunching the numbers, not crunching the eggs, but crunching the numbers. <laughs> what can people expect here? <laughs> Yeah, well, as you mentioned, eggs. Eggs are always on the mind when we think of Easter. And like you said, we will definitely be spending more. The topic of conversation has been how high egg prices have gotten this year. But thankfully, over the last couple of months, those prices have actually started to go back down. Inflation set to have an impact on yet another holiday. According to a survey from Wallet Hub, more than two thirds of Americans who celebrate are planning on spending less for the holiday this year compared to last. The same survey finding almost half of people expect inflation to impact their Easter spending. With prices at the grocery store remaining stubbornly high, plenty of Easter favorites are more expensive this year. We took four foods, eggs, ham, potatoes, and something my family always has on holidays, chips. Using the most recent consumer price index to compare their costs this year versus last. According to the most recent data from February, ham is up over 7.5%, potatoes nearly 22%, and chips 15 But the big concern going into the holiday has been egg prices. Overall, they cost 110% more now than they did last February. But prices dipped significantly from January to February. Welcome news for local shoppers getting in some last-minute items before Sunday. It wasn't as packed as I thought it would be. Um, but price of eggs went down, and that's a good thing. Yeah, he was actually able to get two cartons of eggs for $7. I just moved here from New York, and a couple of months ago, one carton of egg was about $7.50. Live in Raleigh, Harrison Grubb, CBS 17 News. I don't have to buy myself a chicken and a roaster. Yeah, really? <laughs> yeah, that's pricey. <laughs>